and I was asked by the homeowners to come review this foundation and uh, explain what they're seeing. And what I'm seeing is that the efflorescent salt deposit is being deposited in between this patch material and the original uh, structure of the foundation footing that was originally installed. Uh, nothing is waterproofed here to stop this moisture from penetrating. And the efflorescent salt deposit is being deposited right up through here, and that's why it's delaminating this area. Because over time, moisture, these houses are all painted when they're, when they're done. They're only painted down to the top of the dirt. The dirt gets wet below the paint, goes in, evaporates, leaving efflorescent salt deposit. Uh, this happens all over. That's why I do recommend waterproofing from top to bottom to stop the allowance of any moisture going in and penetrating and depositing salt into laminating any patch material or oxidizing any reinforcement steel. Here's another bubble and this is just crumbling off. Uh, it's very easy to pull this off but that's the efflorescent salt deposit right there. The dark spots, the dark spots along here are indicating that moisture is present and will continue to delaminate based on what we've already seen. It's good to have a good gutter system. It's a good gutter system on here and it's taking the moisture uh, away from the home. That's great. back here there's also various spots of discoloration darkness and lightness the contrast and then over time uh, this area uh, just for an example has moisture present and will start to delaminate and deposit the salt like like you just viewed going over here on this side And we do see <clears throat> this darkness, again the contrast, and it's delaminating this patch material. Because this patch material is porous and the moisture gets trapped near the more durable foundation wall. And is delaminating the patch material off because the moisture is trapped behind it. And I'm just using my finger. Uh, so molecular attachment could have been improved probably. Uh, waterproofing would be recommended for sure to stop uh, the allowance of this moisture to get underneath and penetrate and cause this type of delamination. I've always recommended waterproofing foundations because what I do see uh, throughout this region here in Arizona is uh, the paint's only painted down to the top of the dirt. The dirt gets wet below the paint line, goes in, takes the reinforcement steel, delaminates paint, uh, causes spalling, uh, degradation of the surface of the vertical wall. For more information, contact James at 602-418-2970 or you can always go to ConcreteRepairMan.com for more information. Thanks for watching and have a great day.